What's up my baby daddies? You know who it is and you know what I'm here to do. Right now I have in Ali Annabelle and I just wanted to show you guys because I made a video talking about how I really just do this and I just go about my day because literally I take out these little twists. I just wanted to show y'all because I know I didn't put it on the video of me taking out the twist and my hair being fleek. Ah shit. Let me see if you can see it. Uh. You can see it? Uh? I'm gonna go ahead and open up this new package that Annie Annabelle sent me. They sent me a lot of hair. I could just tell by how heavy it is. So I'm gonna do two reviews. I believe they sent me Deep Wave and just Wavy or something like that, but we will see. Woo! When I say bandos on top of bandos on top of bandos. You guys know. A beautiful ass pamphlet. A lot of stores don't have nice pamphlets like that. Obviously this hair was the straight hair and now they sent me the body wave and the kinky curly. So the closures are both 20 inches. I'm sorry about the light. It's like the sun is like coming in at a weird angle but my bad. All the bundles come inside a packaging that looks like this. It just has like a little tag on it. It tells you the length and this so happens to be 26 inches. Girl I wasn't playing with my length. This is the Kinky Curly Unprocessed Virgin Hair from Ali Annabelle. All the bundles are wrapped with a net, and you just take that off and you reveal your bundle. Woo, shiny. Ain't nothing kinky about this. It is really curly though, but this ain't what we call kinky, okay? I can show you some kinky. All right, when it is not pulled, it goes to about 20 inches. And then when you go ahead and pull it down, let's see if we can pull it to 26. Yep, you pull it straight down to 26. I got 26, 26, 24, 24, and a 20 inch closure. The other 26 also goes down to about 20. And then when you stretch it out, it stretches down to the 26. One of these is longer than the other, so I'm gonna do them one at a time. It's 24 and it goes down to 20. Again, when we stretch it, go ahead and pull on it. It goes to 26. <laughs> so I got three bundles of 26. <laughs> Another 24, but this one goes down to like 19. And then when you pull it, it goes to 24. So. Now for the 20 inch closure, I'm gonna just take one of the curls um, for length. Without stretching it, it goes past 10 inches. And then when I stretch that one little baby curl, it goes down to 19 inches. You guys know how this works. I'm gonna put it on a wig, you know what I'm saying? Come back with it styled or how I like to wear it. And I'm gonna give you my review after a month or a little bit longer than that. Sometimes I wear it for longer than a month. But um, yeah, I come back with my final review then. All right, see ya, bye. I am back with a review. The hair looks different, no? Yeah, that's because I did so much to this hair trying to make it work. Pero, you know, sometimes some things you just gotta let it go. The hair was way longer than this, but I just didn't know what to do with it. I put four bundles in, in a closure, and it was so much, I took out two bundles of hair. It looked full of shit, right? And it was long and full. This is the hair that I had in Vegas, thank you. This is how much hair I took out. This is a whole nother wig, y'all. I took out a lot of hair. So this, as you can see, is a lot. This was all in the back. So this was the length of the hair too. It was really long. So I just cut it because I was like, this is a lot, a lot, a lot. I just kind of braided this back because the closure and the bundles don't have the same pattern, but I really love the pattern of the bundles. Like, look at that, so pretty. So um, I did this when the hair was longer and I did it like that in Vegas. And that was cute or whatever for a little while, but now I need to do a different style. Like I can't go like that all the time. I combed the hair out and it was like this big. It was like out to here. And then I shaped it, which you guys probably didn't see. And then I washed it and then now this is what it looks like. So combed it out, I told myself like, I wonder what this hair would look like straight. The reason why I want to see what it looks like straight is because as you can see, this hair texture of the closure is completely different from the texture underneath it. So maybe if I straighten it, that'll make them the same. So let's see what we gotta do. Are you really about to straighten that whole way? No, you about to do it. Ah, <laughs> uh, hell, hell no. I don't even know how to do 
nothing happening, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> no. I'm sorry. I thought I could do a little something, something better. Why well, can't? <laughs> not with this hair. I sorry. That's not okay. That's not happening. Not today. <laughs> it feels nice, but it just don't look nice. Shit looks stiff as fuck. That shit look like nope. <laughs> Wash your hair before you send your hair out to your customers. Like that doesn't even make any sense. Wash your damn hair first. So you know what the texture looks like before you send it to us and you can match them accordingly. Like it don't make no sense when you do stuff like that. Like I don't get it why you would do something like that. And when I was in Vegas, I got a whole bunch of compliments. Everybody was asking where I got my hair from, so. Yeah, um, as long as the closure's out the way, I think it's popping. Maybe the company after seeing this will fix their closure issue. What's up you guys? So there's a long process that I went through um, with this hair. I love Ali Annabelle, I love their hair. This is the third hair texture that I've reviewed for them. I'm gonna tame this. You guys know, I've talked about this hair in my vlogs, um, the curly hair, that the closure didn't match the bundles. What happened was they sent me some hair, um, some bundles and a closure and the closure didn't match the bundles. And I'm gonna grab that right now. I ended up bleaching the knots and the bleach kind of like ran through and came through the lace. So uh, yeah, it's even worse. But here's the other wig with the same hair. Both hairs were much longer. They were 26. As you guys know from the beginning of the video, the lengths were pretty long and they sent me about four bundles. The bundles go a long way because I made two wigs with the bundles. They didn't send me any extra bundles. And as you can see, these are the curls from the bundles like some of the prettiest curls I've ever seen like on a um, on Aliexpress bundle hair like really pretty um, the closure on the other hand is kinky curly <laughs> yeah the closure is definitely kinky curly I don't know why they're different textures um, they're definitely different textures as in like this is rough and this is more silky the curls here are much looser and um, the curls on the closure are much tighter and um, coarser. If it was this all the way through, I probably would have loved it a lot. Like look at that, it looks like black people hair. I love that. This looks more like Brazilian and there's nothing wrong with that, but I just wish that the closure and the bundles matched. I told them that I can't do the review because I don't like that the bundles didn't match. I told them that I had extra bundles. All they have to do is send me a new closure. Hopefully it matches the bundles. So they did just that. They sent me a frontal this time and that's what I have on now. This frontal actually matches the curls of the bundle a little bit better but they still don't match completely. And as you can see, it's really, really poofy, the closure, because I don't know, like the like again, the curls are much tighter on the closure than they are on the bundle. So because it's a frontal, I feel like it blends a little bit better because obviously it goes all the way from the front. I have to give my review still because like I said, I like to be very transparent and I like to tell you guys how it is. This hair, the curly hair, is some of the best curly hair I've ever had. When I was in Vegas, you guys saw the videos and a lot of people were giving me compliments on the hair. So I was almost going to not do the review because I don't want to sabotage your company. Like I said, I don't do bad reviews. I don't want people to be like, oh, that hair company is bad, blah, blah, Because I would hate if someone came on YouTube bashing my company unless I did something wrong to them. You know what I mean? And this company didn't do anything wrong to me. They just kind of messed up with their closures. And it's good for them to know that they messed up with their closures. A lot of the AliExpress companies, after they finish processing the hair, they don't rinse out the process so that you can see what the patterns look like. They still have like those tight coils in it, so you can't tell if the bundles are gonna match the closure. I feel like this is kind of a video bringing awareness to these companies washing their hair before they send it out. Like, I understand you guys want the curls to look really cute and like off the pack y'all want it to look all uniform and stuff. I feel like we would, black people, us black women would appreciate it more if the curls, instead of being uniform, were just they're real curls, like the actual pattern. Like if I wash it, the pattern's not gonna change. At this point, I just wanted to tell you guys about the bundles. Like the bundles are really nice, I love the bundles. Like with this hair, what I plan on doing is just like twisting up the frontal and just <laughs> letting these curls, oh my God, the back curls peep through, girl, because I can't, girl. The bundles get a 10, easy. The closures aren't bad, they just don't match. So the closures get like a, a eight, nine, the bundles get a 10, and then all together as a unit, I'm gonna give it a seven and a half because they don't match. I recommend the hair, I recommend the closure, but not both of them together until they figure it out and fix it. 
and hopefully when they figure it out and fix it they hit me up so I can tell y'all that they fixed it where you can get the bundles and where you can get the closure and where you can get the frontal they're all gonna be down below so if you guys want to get them I'm gonna put them down below for you make sure you go out and do positive things in the world make sure no drama comes from anybody but me because I'm your baby mama now give me a kiss <gasps> This is what it looks like when I do that little bun style that y'all love so much. I ain't about the playful hairstyles, man. 